Sweater weather is here, and I'm gonna be showing you guys how to make your hot cocoa in four different ways. I'm gonna be using the same cocoa base for all of these different recipes, and I want to show you guys one of my new favorite things. It's called Rogue Cocoa. Uh, I don't know if you've heard of it. It's kind of new, but it's this great alternative to hot cocoa or coffee. It's got caffeine in it, so you kind of can kickstart your day with something warm, with something nice, but if you're also an on-the-go type of person, if you're athletic, this is great to really just get you thinking on the ball and on your toes throughout the day, give you a little kick of energy. The other great thing that I love, love about this, and it also comes in coconut, it's only 20 calories for a whole scoop, and I don't even need to use a whole scoop. I'll typically use only like a fourth or half, so when you think of it that way, this goes a long way, and it's only got one gram of sugar and a total of four ingredients. It's super healthy, it's rich, you would not know that it is as healthy as it is. So when you see me making coca today, I am only gonna be using raw cocoa. Link in the description. You guys, <laughs> I love this. My fiance is obsessed with it too. He's literally already used like half the bag because he's had like multiple servings a day, which is maybe not recommended, but you know, if you have a higher tolerance to caffeine, then that's great. <music> I've already got the cocoa mixed up, as you can see here. I've got all my ingredients laid out. We've got the orange, the pirouettes, the marshmallows, the vanilla, the grater, and my measuring cup. So we're gonna take the orange, and we're just gonna take the small side of the grater, and we are going to just grate that into the cup of cocoa. And basically, you're just gonna try and do the whole orange as much as you can, just to get that taste in there. Now the next part, we're gonna take the vanilla and we are going to put about a half teaspoon in there. So I've got a teaspoon there, so I'm filling it halfway. Putting that in there as well, it gives it a little bit of a vanilla cooler taste. Now we're gonna take the fruity marshmallows, put those on top, and then stick some pirouettes on the side. Mmm, yummy. Yeah, Oh, you can see, uh, having a little trouble there. But there we go, finished product, you guys. Oof, looks so good. Next, we've got our pre-made cocoa. We've got our ingredients. We've got whipped cream over here. We've got the candy canes, um, some peppermint flavoring, and then also some like candy canes crushed up or candy cane sprinkles, you could say. And then uh, we're gonna take a half teaspoon of this peppermint oil and just pour that in there, mix it up. I'm gonna take some whipped cream, put a good amount on there. Oof, that's what I like. We're gonna sprinkle a little bit of those candy canes on top and then stick your two baby mini candy canes. Just got them from Dollar Tree right in there. Oh, and look at that matching mug. Voila. <laughs> for a pumpkin pie, my favorite. I've got a pre-mixed. I've got some maple syrup with agave. I've got some pumpkin spice flavoring, two cinnamon sticks, and my whipped cream, of course, and my little measuring spoon. I'm gonna take a half teaspoon of the pumpkin, mix it in, and then I'm gonna take a teaspoon of the maple agave, mix it in as well, then put a good dollop on top of your favorite whipped cream. And of course, we're gonna finish it off with two cinnamon sticks. Delish, this is actually one of my favorites. This last one, Iced Kick. Oof, this is a great one for the morning when you wake up. I got some almond breeze over here to some unsweetened almond milk. I've got my rogue cocoa. We're gonna pour that in there and then just a scoop of the rogue cocoa. So just fill it all the way with ice and almond milk. Put about a scoop of the rogue cocoa in there and then just shake it up like crazy. And you're done. I think the pumpkin, definitely my favorite. Mm. 
I just like a cinnamon stick. No judging. <laughs> so, when you're seeing all the cocoa that I'm doing today, that I'm... So when you see all of the cocoa that I'm making today, know that we're using this rogue cocoa. And I totally just... just, just This orange. Oh gosh. If you guys aren't cat, ca um, 